The Riverside Centre was established in 1981, which was the International Year of Disabled People. The Riverside Centre is very much a coalition of partner organisations, disabled and non-disabled, covering most of the voluntary sector on the Isle of Wight. We provide a range of activities from wood workshops, gym, craft workshop, and we have a restaurant which is a social enterprise run by the Riverside Centre, but very much part of our social firm inclusive ethos. The Riverside also works with partner agencies to provide a range of community activities, for example the River Fest later in the year and we are involved with the Newport Jazz Festival weekend and again we use the facilities for the benefit of the community and very much work as part of our social firm culture. We've got very extensive links with many many groups on the Isle of Wight, over 300 organisations use the Riverside on an annual basis. We are home to a range of groups and organisations such as the Stroke Association, Autistic Society and similar groups. We are very much fortunate that we work with White Mind to provide mental health daycare activities in Key House and in the Riverside Centre and we also work with the Green Gym and Footprint Trust to look after allotments very close by to the Riverside Centre. So it's quite a comprehensive package of activities, facilities and services. We also work with the Isle of Wight Carers Association, which are part of the National Carers Association. And with that organisation, we run a project called Key Carers, which provides respite activities for carers, as well as support to the individuals that are cared for. This is the um, spring display we've just started. All the clients making flowers for it. So yeah, we're just getting all of this. charity we fundraise so we provide a range of activities that generate income so room hires that type of thing generates income we have a trading arm which is Riverside Ventures which employs disabled and non-disabled people in the restaurant and other facilities and that generates income and also increasingly with personal budgets we get income that way and as a charity we can apply for grants and we get quite a range of support from different organisations. Very fortunately on the island that we've received contributions from quite a range of groups and have done for some time. Hey Scarf, I'm a volunteer at Riverside. Yeah. And I uh, come down here a couple of days a week and uh, help out in the IT. So it's uh, clients that, uh, that come to the uh, centre on a daily basis, plus uh, people from the outside who want to uh, be introduced to computers. So uh, Gary and myself uh, run uh, taster courses for people, getting them uh, in, into uh, computers. Uh, either on the equipment that you can see here or they bring in their own laptops and uh, we help them to uh, uh, use them in an efficient and enjoyable way. I hope. Yeah.